Hello guys, this is Barney Morset from the Technology Guide Test Lab, and today we're going to take a look at Verizon's uh, Moto G. This is uh, available list price, not one and nine, but uh, most uh, re outlets are coming in for only a hundred bucks now. And it's also part of Verizon's newer effort into prepaid. So you get a nice sort of a gas station packaging and a bubble pack. We did do the favor of not making you watch me tear through this and hack through it, but basically it's uh, open up and you get the Moto 3G, sorry, Moto G. First thing to be noted is that being it's Verizon, I just assume this is a 4G LTE phone. It is not. It is 3G. So just be aware off the bat for 99 bucks does not get you into the uh, high-speed data that Verizon is known for. That being said, aside from that shortage, this is a pretty good solid phone for a prepay phone if you're looking to get into an Android or smartphone type uh, prepay. So it's basically got a 5 megapixel shooter on the back. It's got a flash. It's a nice solid construction. There's no flex to that back. Sort of a, po it's a polycarbonate plastic back. It's got a little bit of grip to it, but not a lot. Not a lot. Very, very little. Oh, don't want to turn that off. It's a running uh, Android 4.3, although the website says it's guaranteed to be upgraded. So I'm assuming KitKat will be coming down the pipe pretty soon for these guys. We ran some 3D Mark bench tests on it. It scores pretty well. It's a quad core Snapdragon 400 processor. In the whole world of Motorola, uh, sorry, whole world of Android phones out there right now, it's about 180 in the list. What again? For a $99 prepay is not a bad deal. Um, also out there, we ran it through pass marks, so it gives some benchmarks. But what you're getting here again is a nice, solid built Motorola phone. Air Motorola, is, despite their current ownership changes, still makes great product. It's a good, solid build. There's not a lot of, uh, again, flex the case. I'm hoping some deep, good durability on it. And we'll get back to us a more finer detail about the features and see if this can, uh, is a worthy successor to other $99 phones out there and see if it's worth your money. This is Barney Morset from the Tesla.